moment for very many people though a very different atmosphere tonight let's leave it now 10 seconds to go the recorded sound of Big Ben in Downing Street. We are no longer a member of the European Union. The scenes there in Parliament Square where the celebrations begin. And so begins the next chapter for the United Kingdom. We have now formally left the EU after 47 years. We are no longer EU citizens. Let's go straight to Parliament Square now and Vicky Young, who is there. Yeah, and there may have been muted celebrations in Downing Street tonight. That has not been the case here. All evening, speeches from leading Brexiteers, singing, chanting, renditions of God Save the Queen, Royal Britannia. And then in the final moments before we left the European Union, Nigel Farage, the person many credit with putting pressure on the Conservative Party and making sure that Brexit happened. Tonight, as he addressed the crowds here, he said, some people said this wasn't to be celebrated. He said it was. It was a victory, he said, for democracy. He said, we beat the establishment who didn't want the referendum. They didn't want this to happen. But he also said that this wasn't the end, that there would be battles ahead, and he would be standing by to make sure that Boris Johnson did deliver. When it comes to things like fishing, when it comes to making sure that the uh, European Court of Justice doesn't have a role, he says he will be keeping an eye on what goes on in the next year and absolutely huge cheers here as that moment came well we'll leave the celebrations there in parliament square for now and we are going to go to our island correspondent emma vardy who is on the border the, the uk new has border left the european the union and the european union new start for my over the pond friends y'all have a great evening takes on a great new significance this where i'm standing